everyone. This is Michaela Cross reporting from Youth Ops Magazine. Welcome to the National Nail Your Day reports. November 3rd is National Nail Your Day. On this day, BGLO members have been issued their challenge. Their challenge is to wear nail ya or organization colors proudly all day. This purpose of Nail Your Day is to show our communities how sororities and fraternities give added value in society and across the nation in our respective communities. Most importantly, they not only step or party, they vote. With the founding of the first African-American fraternity in 1906, the fraternity and sorority system in our communities have helped improve daily living when it comes to education, skill and development, and health-related projects. Many of these members serve as teachers, clergy, government officials, and business leaders in everyday life. To see BGLO members collectively wearing their nail yet on November 3rd will not only make a statement to their missions and aim, but will also serve as a visual reminder to young people, like me, that the act of voting is something to be taken very seriously. Today, I have a member from One Org here to talk about what he will be wearing on November 3rd. But first, let's learn from him why voting is so important and how his organization hasn't educated the masses on why vote and why everyone should vote and embracing the power of the vote. Today, I have Mr. Eric Tucker with me today, and we are happy to have you with us today. First, please tell us why voting is important to you and how has your organization influenced you and the others on the importance of voting? Hello, Michaela. It is a pleasure to talk to you today. I'm happy to be here. Um, as far as um, why voting is so important to me, it is basically because it is the right that so many of our ancestors fought and died for. Uh, just to have us counted and recognized. And um, it is part of the, the democratic process. I mean, it, without your vote, uh, you don't have a say in how you know, our democracy is run. So it's important to me to be able to participate. You can't complain if you don't participate. You can't improve things if you don't participate. And you gotta pay homage to the folks that, that actually gave their lives and, and so many sacrifices in order for us to have the right, the freedom to be able to participate. So that's why it's important to me personally. Um, as far as what my organization um, is doing to increase awareness for the voter registration process and the election process in general. Um, we have national programs um, that Phi Beta Sigma Fraternity participates in, um, but on a local level here in Dallas, my chapter, my graduate chapter, Theta Mu Sigma, we have local voter registration activities where we go particularly to different um, you know, housing complexes and neighborhoods and pretty much just pounding the pavement, knocking on doors, asking people if they're registered, if they require assistance. And we volunteer to bring the registration to them pretty much and, and make it easy um, on our website. People can sign up to check their registration status and then also register to vote um, if they haven't done so already. Um, and hey, we're, we're trying to make sure everybody is counted. That's amazing, making sure everyone is counted. I noted that in my notebook. So I see a little bit of your fraternity shirt and your necklace, but could you tell me a little bit more about that and what you plan on wearing on November 3rd? Well, this shirt, this is my my standard Sigma shirt, my Sigma gray. Every day is Sigma day here. So, you know, um, it's, it's just what I love. I, I, you know, I've collected so many of these um, uh, over the years, but I'm proud of my organization and the things that uh, it stands for, the activities. Um, my children know that it's near and dear to me and, and, and they love participating in some of the social events that we have as well. As far as um, what I'll be wearing November 3rd, I, I've already early voted, which I encourage and challenge everyone to do if it's still available, but um, I'm still going to be going to the polls to because we've signed up to uh, help transport people 
to the polls and I'll be wearing our officially sanctioned vote shirt, Phi Beta Sigma, your vote counts. So um, that's what you'll see me in. We'll be socially distancing from one another, but not from the right to vote. So get out and make it count. Thank you. Go out and make it count. I will remember that. And whoever sees this will remember that amazing saying. I just want to thank you, Mr. Eric, for taking the time out of your precious day to share words of wisdom with us. Well, thank you. Like I said, it's my pleasure. And I appreciate your professionalism and your eagerness to do this. So I've had a great time and I look forward to seeing more of your work in the future. Thank you so much. This is Michaela Cross reporting from the Youth Ops Magazine. Make sure to tune in into our next segment on National Nail Your Day reports with my junior colleagues and I. Until then, when it comes to November 3rd, start thinking, who will you be wearing? <laughs>